Is the museum haunted, Julian? <laughs> and we are wondering if anybody happens to be hanging around the Oakville Museum who would like to speak to us. Shuttle. Maybe somebody's buried here and we need to dig them up. What happened to me? Spirit Box just said what happened to me. Electric Angel. Electric Angel. Did you see that spike there? Like whatever it was picking up is now gone. So I've worked at a number of museums and historic sites, and I've never worked at a historic site or museum that didn't have a reputation of being haunted. Mm -hmm. I've also never seen anything that I couldn't explain. Oh, okay. <laughs> I have no evidence for haunting at the museum. So I'm here today with Paul. Paul is over there. And uh, doing a little bit of a ghost hunt at the Oakville Museum. I don't know if we're gonna get anything. There are rumors it's haunted. Paul did a video here, one of his Oakville spotlights here, and talked to uh, Julian, this is the gentleman's name, and when he asked Julian if this place was haunted. So we are approaching Halloween, and I have to ask, is the museum haunted, Julian? Julian did not give him a definite answer one way or the other. Just kind of a nervous little chuckle. <laughs> So guys, if you guys are starting to YouTube, it's probably wise to have some sort of focus or niche and you guys have seen Brian in a million of my videos and uh, if you guys don't know, he does ghost hunting stuff on this channel and uh, he was kind enough or cool enough to invite me over to uh, one of his ghost hunting expeditions. We're at the Oval Museum and we're going to try to find something. I'm here with my friend Paul today and my name is Brian. I'm going to go right up to the window and see if we can see inside a little bit. In. Here's my. So we can see a staircase. And some doors right here. Shovel. What was that? Shovel. Shovel? Shovel. What does that mean? I don't know. Maybe. Shovel. Somebody dug here. Maybe someone's buried here. Maybe somebody's buried here and we need to dig them up. Interesting. Yeah, the words you get sometimes are interesting. And how does it, like, it just, like, like how does it work? <laughs> so apparently, what, what the theory is, is that there's electromagnetic fields, and your phone generates one, yeah. and spirits can take that energy and use it to communicate. Oh, okay. And they put words through this app. Right. So I have had, through other apps, like at Steve's place, I had the name Steve come through clear as day. Anyway, I think we're gonna wrap up the short. So what's the plan here? So here we're gonna do ghost tube. Okay. And uh, I'm gonna ask Paul a few questions for oh. my video. Oh, good, let's do it. Let's... Paul's just filming some video for his video. So Paul, oh, you shooting? Yep. Ask... you believe in ghosts? Uh, I do, I do believe in, um, in like afterlife stuff. So if that's ghosts, then yes, I guess the answer is yes. Okay. I like to believe that there's something after uh, after we pass that this is not just it. Have I seen any ghosts? No. Okay, so we're gonna send Paul, and yeah. I'll give him the footage from Ghost Tube as well, yeah. so he can put it in his video. Yeah. We're gonna send Paul alone around the building just to see if he gets anything right, right. using Ghost Tube, right. because different people sometimes can cause different things to happen. I am a magnet. Paul or something. So, we'll see what Paul gets. If he gets anything, right. we'll make sure the footage goes in this video. <laughs> because that'll be cool too. Goes to okay. crime. <laughs> That's on Paul's bit. Not on my bit. I'm actually. Oh, I'll, right got, I'll, send, I'll send that to you. I'll but send that clip to you. That's crime. <laughs> Crime? Crime. Like C-R-I-M-E. Crime. <laughs> what? Oh, man. Anyway, that's we're great. Gonna Paul around that's great. With Ghost Tube. <laughs> okay. Coming with my phone. See what he gets. Let's walk around to the front of the museum. I kind of like this doorway, too. I wonder if there's someone in the window. It'd be cool if someone got in the window there. It's actually closed today, so the uh, museum's not open. So if we do see someone, it's going to be really strange. Is the front of the museum? Is anyone with us? Let's 
see if there's anyone. Anyone with us here? Robert? Bob? Okay. There's a family there. Someone on the bench with us? Is there anyone with us at the Oakland Museum? Nothing? Give me something. I have to have something back when I get back to Brian. It's kind of embarrassing. Is there anyone with this? Yeah, this is where Brian got the word shovel on the back porch. So, is there anyone here with us? You can go on the porch. Anyone with us here? Anyone with us? Anyone with us here? Brunch? Okay, I got nothing. Robert? Mr. Chisholm? Mr. Chisholm? This is slightly embarrassing, I didn't get anything for it. Slightly. I guess I'm fired, so. Is that right? Yeah. Robert, are you with us? I was trying to get around. I'm that. really trying because it's slightly embarrassing. I got nothing for it. How you. How do got, you feel? How do I feel? <laughs> Frustrated. <laughs> Just ask Paul how he was feeling after not getting nothing. <laughs> That's so weird. Well, at least I got something for you. I don't. But, I don't feel as bad. Yeah, but how do I feel? Or how do you feel? Just talking about how frustrated he was. About yes. Nothing. Yes. So it is an interesting response. That is an interesting response. Anyway, so let's talk up from here, move to a different area. Break out the spirit box. Sweet. Nice. Spirit box is right. Yeah, I just see this thing. Where'd you buy it from? Uh, ghost hunting tools. Oh. So actually a website called Ghost, ghost Hunting Tools? Yeah. Okay. Is that, I guess that's the place to buy ghost hunting stuff? Yeah. <laughs> it's they, the best yeah, buy of ghost actually, hunting. Ghost shop, ghoststop.com. Okay. Is not sponsored? Not yet. Not sponsored. Yet. Maybe someday. Yes. So this is the S box. Okay. There are a couple different ones you can get. This one also allows you to record EVPs if you want. So that's okay. why I got this one. The only downfall with this one was the on-off switch actually broke on me. Oh no! So, but I just take out the battery and... Oh, is that how you turn it on? That's how I turn it on, just put in the battery. Wow. But it actually still works, just not the on off. Oh, that's... Mm -hmm. So... Fix that up, ghost hunting yeah. store. So, we, we're gonna do what's called an AM sweep. Okay. It basically scans through AM frequencies. Like AM radio? Yeah, AM radio. Okay. Super fast and... Uh, Sometimes you'll pick up responses to the questions you're asking. Um, I usually have uh -huh. somebody who reviews the uh, Spirit Box audio for me. Yeah, ver verify. Uh, I don't give them any hints or anything. I just want to hear, find out if they're hearing the same thing. Yeah. And never in my videos yeah. will I put what I think I hear. Yes. Because of the power of suggestion. Right, right. Because once someone says something, then yeah, you th exactly. you're looking for the word, basically. Exactly. Mm -hmm. So I... I always ask people, you know, if you hear anything, comment below. Yeah. But I am not putting on the screen what I think yeah. I hear yeah. because I want to know if you hear the same thing right. that I'm hearing. Credibility. 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 Yeah. Yeah. That makes sense. So anyway, I'm going to get my camera running. Okay. And we're going to go stand over there. Let's do it. And let's spirit box see, this uh, mother. See. All right. Let's turn up the volume. And we will start the sweep. So I'm sure you've seen this in other ghost hunting vids that use a spirit box. So basically right now it's just sweeping through AM frequencies. It's just using the radio to, to form words, basically. Mm. So we just want to know if there's anybody at the Oakville Museum. Yeah, is Robert here with us? Maybe, Because you asked me how I felt and I was frustrated. So thanks for your consideration.
you know, I don't like to put too much of this in my video because yeah. noise people yeah. don't yeah don't like to just watch the noise. But it is a tool that I like to mix in. Yeah. And as I acquire more tools, I'll put yep. those in as well. Last chance, if you're here, and you want to use this tool to say hello, I'd love to hear from you. I'm going to turn that off. Okay, so yeah. that is All a spirit right. box. Okay. I'm going to... Should we try the porch? The back porch yeah. of the spirit box? Yeah. Yeah, we can. I'm going to start a new clip here, though, and okay. we're going to do a Vox session here. Okay, Vox. Yeah. Let's Vox it up. We're using Ghost 2 Vox. My camera is pointed to Paul, who's going to walk around and film through the app. Yep. And this is the only legitimate ghost hunting app that does not come preloaded with a dictionary of words. Love to have something really good for Paul. Yeah, please. All right. I think not much happening out front here. Mm -hmm. So let's go back to the back porch. All right. Fire up the spirit box there again. Let's do it. See what happens. Spirit box it up. Okay. So I'm actually going to put the spirit box on the bench here. Okay. So I've got the camera there filming. It's all there filming. Spirit box right here on the back of the porch. The is kind of going off a little bit. Is that? Yeah. Spirit box what happened to me? Porch. Spirit box just said what happened to me. You've got a magnetometer here. And it was going off? It's a lot higher than normal. Like. What does that mean? Energy? Energy. So like yeah. if I put it near a bat, see? Right there, look. Right down. Yeah. Low, low, low. Electric angel. Electric angel. Electric angel? Electric and angel. Super See? weird. Yeah. That's that's actually really high. Like the magnetometer's not usually that high. Like, oh, See? That's that's more what the magnetometer is normally. Yeah, and then it just spiked, eh? Yeah, it went up. Just to show, I go over to my camera here, just for Paul's benefit. See, hi, hi. Watch when I go near the battery on my camera. Goes up. Now it's even higher. Did you see that spike there? Yeah. And now it's gone. It's weird. Whatever it was picking up is now gone. That was... Wow, man. That was interesting. I mean, jeez. So, as you, as you can see, there's... It's low now yeah. compared to how it was. Like, yeah. And it never happens like that. No. No, not in, oh, in the open like this. Not unless you bring it near something. Yeah. So. Okay, so there's stuff to work with here. How do I use it? How do I use it? <laughs> you just use wow. the energy and come close. Wow, that's yeah. so weird. Just come close. What? Bring your energy close. <laughs> And this meter will pick it up. Do you want to communicate with us? Are you Robert? Are you Robert? Are you someone else that used to live here? I'm coming. Oh my god. Do you have something to say to us? Are you here, Robert? Are you even Robert? What's your name? So that was super weird. Uh, Brian said that uh, it never spikes like that. And as soon as we turn off our gear, we got the name Jonathan. So we need to Google Jonathan and the Oakville Museum because Seriously. there's someone here. He said he was coming on the spirit box. Ghost so, Ghost 2. And uh, 
So thanks, Jonathan, if you're here. Maybe maybe you want to try one more time? Say I think it again? we should try one more, one more time. time. We'll try one more time and see if we get anything else. So a little live research here. Yeah, I'm Jonathan. recording through Ghost Tube. The camera over there is still recording so this whole thing. Amazing. That camera actually has Jonathan on it, you know? That camera's still running. I haven't shut that oh. camera off yet. Oh, so you got it. I'm gonna have to do a little bit of research. Yeah. See if we can find the name Jonathan. Grandfather. Oh, grand. Grandfather. John Jonathan's a grandfather. I wonder if Robert had a grandfather named Jonathan. Yeah. So in typical ghost tube fashion. Yeah. As soon as I stop recording and turn everything off. Yeah, forget something. Ghost tube asked who I was. So hopefully you guys are enjoying this video. I'm really glad that we got stuff for you. And uh, we're gonna do one more Vox section. One, we're gonna do one more Vox session, and then I think we're gonna wrap this up. But I think we're gonna come back and do the inside when this place is open, and maybe do like a night walk around this area because there is uh, the old post office, which is just across the park there, and there's some old churches here. So this whole area could be really just prime with yep. ghosts, man. Yeah, night walk in this area for sure. Yeah. I'll come and do that. Yeah. And then eventually getting inside, even if all I can do is a quick run around with ghost tube inside. Yeah. I think uh, I think I think we need to at this point. Alright. Ghost tube box. I think before we wrap this up I'll show Paul the filters. Yeah. Yeah that actually those filters are pretty cool, man. Yeah, I'll show them to you. Yeah. Did it just freeze? Did it? Just froze. Weird. Jonathan, is that you? <laughs> Maybe it's interfering with the electronics. Yeah, the app is totally frozen. Jonathan? All right, okay. Great. Turn this off. I'm just gonna shut this one off. And uh, I'll show you the filters for your vid. Yeah. Because I've already yep. done them in mine. Yep. All right, you ready? Yeah. Okay, so one of the things that GhostTube has is filters yep. that can give a different look to your video. So I'm gonna okay. have it here. You can't change them once you're recording. Okay. Yeah. You've got the, the kind of night vision look. Okay. You've got this, give yep. it a nighttime yep. kind of look. Okay. This blocky kind of thing. Okay. And these are just used to see things better? Differently. Different, not, okay. not better or worse. Okay. This one kind of imitates thermal. Okay, so you can pick up more energy, I guess. But they they or... give you a different contrast, mm. so. Okay. And then this one is actually a negative. Oh, that's cool. I dig that. Father. Oh, <gasps> father. Jonathan, are you a fa So it said father and grandfather. I think we need to look up Robert Kirchism. And his family tree. <laughs> yeah. You got that on your camera yeah, at least. So. Yeah. And then back to the normal filter. So, yeah, those are the filters that are available. They just give you different looks. Uh, I don't play with them too much. Yeah. But sometimes they can be fun. Which one's your favorite to use usually? Uh, I like the green one in abandoned houses. Yeah. I also like the negative one. Yeah. There's, I'm going to show you one more app actually. Okay. Uh, just. I don't, I haven't used it much and I haven't done a full test on it yet, but it's called SLS, which yeah. stands for Structured Light Simulator. Okay. And the easiest way to show you this one is actually to record you through the app. Okay. So I will share it, or actually use the app and record me. Okay. Are you getting lines? Uh, yeah. Yeah? Yep. So if I do something like yeah, that. Yeah, it's going to pick up the structure. Yeah. Yeah, it's picking up the structure. So if there was a ghost, it pick up the structure of the ghost? Yeah, so you kind of point this at an empty room, and if it picks up movement like that. Yeah, I'll pick it up. something there. Okay. That's cool. Is and, that free, or you got to pay for that? Uh, again, you have to, if you want all the perks of it, you pay. Yeah. Uh, but the free version, you get the, the shorter recording limit. Right. And... 720 through the app. Ah, I gotcha. Yeah. Always the upgrade, eh? Upgrade, the upgrade, in, oh, upgrade yes. in the app. Upgrade in the app. But they always up. They always do updates, and oh. if you use it, then it's worth paying for. I guess. Yeah. Is that, that it? Are we wrapping it That's up? That's it. I'm gonna shoot my closing. Okay. You can shoot All right, shoot my closing. Great. So hopefully you guys enjoy this video. Um, you know, 
I'm glad that we got something to show you guys because it just goes to show you that uh, maybe there are ghosts out there. So big thanks to Jonathan. We're gonna have to do some more research. And uh, thanks to Brian for inviting me along. And uh, I, Brian, like, like how, like, how does this rate so far in like your ghost hunting ex expeditions in like top um, five, top ten so far? This one got some new cool stuff that yeah. I haven't had happen before. Which okay, is amazing. Yeah, good. So. so yeah. Uh, I'll link uh, Brian's stuff below. You go check out his video. Also, I love collages because you gotta see different approaches on like the same video. So you see my approach, and you see Brian's approach. And I think that's super cool. And uh, yeah, that's about it. We'll wrap it up. But thanks for watching. Subscribe. Sub su subscribe to subscribe Brian. All subscribe to me. Subscribe to everyone in the world. And uh, also subscribe to Jonathan because he, he's probably on YouTube too. Yeah. And uh, we'll see you next one. Peace. Hello. Are you? Hi, uh, uh, bud. Are you hanging out? You, you, you want to go inside? Oh. Do you want pets? I can give you pets. There you go. If the dog starts barking, then we know <laughs> something's up. Give you more pets. Bark three times if you see Jonathan. <laughs> <laughs> right, bud? Right, bud? Right, bud? Yeah. You might be on YouTube or no? Can I get a yes? I'd like to subscribe. Click the notification bell for more. I post these every Sunday, 8 o'clock. Shorts here and there. Just got TikTok. Oh, hello! 2022, Brian's on TikTok. Things are getting weird. <laughs> I love it. Yeah. I love it. I don't know. If you're not everywhere, you're nowhere. Yeah, I know. Let's find something. We just want to know if there's anybody at the Oakville Museum. Yeah.